Sean here. Last night I had a dream. And here's how I drew it up and made it come true. What we have is a blank piece of paper with lines of colored pencil drawn that denote the dimensions of the drawing of the boat. And this is where we start from. Use a straight edge. Make everything nice and square. Using the scale one inch equals one foot. Now you see I got my straight edge out and I got it on a curve. I can move it around, flex it around to get the curve I want that makes the shape of the boat. The way you do that is you got nails. You got two nails on each end. You move it around and there's a trick to it. it makes it really easy. You take a screwdriver, you put it in your chest and you move your body forward to get just the right curve you need. You can move the screwdriver back and forth. That's the way you draw the shape of the boat. Use my straight edge, I drew the lines. These are the ones I decided on. I wouldn't call it a kayak, but it's only seven and a half feet long. It's, it's not really a kayak. You can't call it a hydroplane because it's not a three-pointer. So I'm going to have sponsors on it, but they're not sponsors like a hydroplane has. They're going to be towards the back. And the reason why they're towards the back is it helps to lift the weight of the engine and the passenger out of the water. Therefore, making it a surface skimming craft. You need enough area. You need something out there to help lift the boat. And those are the sponsors. It's going to keep you up in the water. Then I take it over to the workshop after I clean it up. <laughs> and then I build it out of balsa wood. Okay, now I'm going to draw the sponsors. We're in the early design stage of the game here, so I just take a piece of uh, skewer from uh, Thai street food and I move it around until I get the idea of where I want it. And next I'm going to draw it out and cut it out with scissors. I'm hoping you can see this. This is a long tail shaft. Then the boat, the long tail engine. Seat. This is where I'm sitting. This is where my feet go. So the idea is well, this is a cockpit. That's a sport some weight. And you don't need a lot of uh, area because you're going to have the sponsors that are going to help out. It's a minimalist design. It's going to fit in the back of a pickup truck. That's the whole idea about it. It's a pickup truck buddy. So these are the parameters. When you build a boat, you got to have a parameters so the boat works for the function that you designed it for. So this will do it. Tailgate will close and the spots that fit in alongside of it. The tail and the edge that goes in the back of the pickup truck. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to take my uh, skewer <laughs> I'm going to move it around. I'm going to decide where I want the sponsor. So, okay, I got them here now. And I just want to show you that this is how far I've gotten the design. And I'm going to take a picture of this soon. And then I'm going to import it into the computer. But this is about what I want. Uh, you know, where I'm sitting, where I have to sit, the engine goes where it has to go, the boat's the minimal size, it's just a cockpit. And I don't really think that these pontoons are the right size, they're just too big. So we're going to put it in the computer now. I take a photograph of it. I'm going to import it. And here it is. Hi, Sean Walker here again. Last night I had a dream. This dream. Then I went out to the drawing board, showed you how I drew it up, photographed it, imported it into PaintShop Pro, and adjusted it until I got this image here. And what it is, is the Tongdi Truck Buddy Tri-Cat. Uh, it's a Tri-Cat. It fits in the back of a pickup truck between the wheel wells of the tailgate closed. You slide it out, you put it in the water, 
put the engine on it, and you go. You can take to any river. You don't need a launch ramp. You can haul out in the middle of the wilderness and put it in the water where you wouldn't think you could. So this is my idea. I hope you like it. Hope you enjoyed the video. And don't forget to have fun.